Dirty fasting. Do you know how it works and if it's at all beneficial? If you're struggling to find all the necessary information about this mysterious fasting pattern, or you may be considering trying out this relatively new weight loss trend, then this video is for you. Dirty fasting keeps getting more and more attention amongst intermittent fasting fans and amateurs. This fasting pattern usually goes hand in hand with another definition, clean fasting. Let's dive into those two fasting methods to understand how they actually work. To explain the difference between clean and dirty fasting, let's take the 16-8 fasting method as an example. 16-8 is the most popular pattern when you eat during an 8-hour window, and for the rest 16 hours, you fast. During your fasting window, you can't consume any calories, so it means no food or sweetened drinks. You can only drink unsweetened beverages such as water, tea, or black coffee. So that's what exactly clean fasting is consuming only calorie-free and unsweetened beverages during your fasting window. In comparison, dirty fasting allows consuming up to 100 calories during fasting. This means you can consume diet drinks, some low-calorie food, as well as sweeteners, or other additions to your tea and coffee. For example, during dirty fasting, you can add one tablespoon of honey to your tea, which would be around 64 calories, or drink one cup of bone broth, which is around 100 calories. To make it easier for you, here's a list of foods you can consume during a dirty dirty fasting window. However, even though you technically are allowed to consume non-caloric sweeteners, you put yourself at risk for overeating. According to research, non-caloric sweeteners may increase appetite and maintain cravings for sweet food. Another study shows that switching drinks with non-caloric sweeteners to water helped women lose weight. So we recommend that you think twice hmm. before choosing sweet beverages instead of water. Okay, even though that sounds pretty simple, of course, there is a twist. Although consuming a few calories isn't the same as having a full meal, technically you're not fasting. You may think now, but if you break a fast during your fasting window, won't it make intermittent fasting completely useless? And that's where all the discussions begin whether dirty fasting is at all beneficial. First of all, it depends on what your goals are and what you're expecting from fasting. The thing is, even though you're still consuming some calories during dirty fasting, calorie restriction will still be effective for your weight loss. This is simply because you'll be consuming way fewer calories when dirty fasting than you would during a typical day of eating without time restrictions. However, fasting itself is popular not only because of effective weight loss, some people choose clean intermittent fasting for other health benefits such as promoting autophagy, reducing insulin resistance, and blood sugar levels. There's no scientifically proven evidence that dirty fasting is as effective as traditional and clean fasting methods for promoting these potential benefits. This means that dirty fasting may not have the same effects as traditional fasting methods that involve zero calorie intake during fasting periods. So why should you even consider trying dirty fasting? First of all, some people find it really difficult to cut out caloric beverages or food for 16 or more hours, so they'd rather add some cream to their coffee or drink diet soda. The thing is, the flavors and some calories during dirty fasting can give you the satiety and satisfaction you need to stick with fasting, and that's a positive thing. However, if you're not seeing the results you want and you're not losing weight, dirty fasting can be the reason why. Then you definitely should go with a clean fast. Try it out for yourself and see which method works best for you. We're all built differently, so maybe you're the lucky one who can practice dirty fasting and have success. Want to find out more about different intermittent fasting methods? Check out our intermittent fasting play playlist. And if you're struggling with losing weight during clean fasting, watch the video Top 10 Foods to Eat for Intermittent Fasting. Stay safe, stay healthy, and keep watching Health Insider.